Hi everyone, we're going to find the explicit formula and the recursive formula for the arithmetic sequence described. We were given the 13th term and the 25th term. So we have the 13th term, which is a sub 13, which equals 175, and our 25th term, which is 55. So we want to write our explicit formula, which would be a sub n equals a1 plus n minus 1 times d, and our recursive formula, which is a sub n equals a sub n minus 1, which is the previous term, plus d. So the first thing we need to find is our first term and our common difference. And the way we're going to do that is set up a system of linear equations. So we know the 13th term equals a sub 1 plus n, our n is 13 here. So it's going to be 13 minus 1 times d. Okay, that means our 13th term equals 175 equals a sub 1 plus 12d. Now for the second one, we have our n is 25. So a sub 25 is 55 equals a sub 1 plus and we have 25 minus 1 is going to be, um, so that's going to be 24d. Now, we set it up, our system of linear equations. I'm going to put 175 equals a plus a sub 1. I'll just put a 12d. And the second equation is 55 equals a plus 24d. And we're going to use elimination. So what I'm going to do is just subtract. So when you subtract these, you get 120. And a minus a is just 0. And 12 minus uh, 24 is negative 12d. And divide both sides by negative 12. You're going to get negative 10 equals your d. So we have our d equals negative 10, and now we find our a. You plug your a uh, d back into one of these. Um, I'll just plug it into, let's say, this one. It doesn't really matter. You get 175 equals a minus 120. Because negative 10 times 12 is 120. Add 120, and you get 395 equals A. So 395 equals A. So now writing our explicit term, um, D is negative 10. And my first term is 395. So our explicit term is a sub n equals my first term plus n minus 1 times d, which is negative 10. And then you merely clean this up and simplify. So basically you get uh, negative 10 n, and you add 10 to this, you get 405. Right, so that's your explicit term or formula, and then for our recursive formula, our current term is a sub n minus one plus d, and all you do is plug in the d, so a sub n equals a sub n minus one minus ten. So there's your two formulas, and that's all. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.